Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is the 18th of February and it is a Friday, so that means today is weigh day. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a weigh-in update. I'm starting a little bit late today. It is currently 20 past 11, so I am sorry if this video does go up a little bit later. Um, I did actually wake up at half eight and then I fell back to sleep till about half ten-ish. And then I had a shower, which is why my hair is wet. Um, I didn't want this video to run any later than what it is so i am gonna blow dry it after but as with every way in video i will tell you how this week has gone how much i have maintained gained or lost this week and then i will tell you what i'm going to be doing going forward to the week ahead i am sorry if you can hear any rain or any wind it is absolutely horrible out there today it is supposed to reach 70 mile an hour winds i think here and it is really bad so as you oi as you can imagine, it's impossible getting these girls out. This is Lily. Lola's downstairs. And I also think my battery's going to die. So if you just wait there one second. Right, I'm back. So as if anything else couldn't go wrong today, my battery ran out of battery. So I'm going to get straight into today's video. I haven't actually written anything down this week. Nothing this week has stood out to me. I feel like this week has flown by so fast that I can't really think about what happened this week um Friday I had my normal treat meal um so I went over on that day Saturday Sunday I was under my calories but obviously you didn't see the filming because um everything was corrupted Monday was Valentine's Day so I didn't track and then every day after that, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, I was on track and under calories. The closest I got to being near my calories was 92 calories off. So that's really, really good. I'm not normally that close, but I suppose I was extra hungry that day. Let me just double check. I haven't written anything. I'm pretty sure I haven't. Yeah, didn't even delete it from last week. So yeah, let me try and remember back. So... To be honest, not a lot stands out to me about this week. Let me just go to my Instagram. I haven't really uploaded to Instagram either. I did have some amazing things which I will show you. I haven't updated my stuff because I knew I would be screen recording. So don't try and cheat. God, my hair looks bad, work, doesn't it? <laughs> but yeah, so last night's dinner was absolutely incredible. And also last week's um lunch was amazing i absolutely love the aldi salads i did buy quite a few yesterday because they're just so quick and easy um and normally at lunch is what i kind of struggle with so i just want quick easy things i don't have to think about I just pull it out the i just pull it out the kitchen drawer and it's like done also the chicken fajita stir fry that i made from aldi absolutely incredible i did add some extra chili powder in there probably wouldn't do that again because it was really hot even though it's mild chili powder it was burning my ass <laughs> um but yeah that was enjoyable my salad with the wedges not wedgies i did realize but i couldn't cut it out otherwise you wouldn't know what i was talking about um that was an incredible salad as well also the rice with the sweet chili sauce was amazing and you know i do love my aldi um what's it called aldi fish incredible one of my go-to breakfasts is fruit and yogurt made an amazing porridge on valentine's day which i didn't count yeah that's i haven't uploaded on instagram either this week i don't know this week has been i feel like it's gone really really well um i feel like i have stopped myself from binging this week haven't had any binges haven't craved any anything that would make me go over my calories it's been a really good week to be honest with um binges and stuff like that as i said i haven't really i haven't binged this week at all um and to be honest i do feel a lot better for it a lot less stressed out i feel a lot more happy a lot more energetic i'm feeling so much more motivated than i have been the past few weeks so that's really really good i feel like i feel like that gain last week if you haven't watched last week's video i will link it up here i feel like last week's gain really really kicked me in the ass and made me realize why i'm doing it and that i don't want to stop 
and that I need to carry on with what I'm doing and try not to let things stress me out, which yes, I know people get stressed out, but I'm just so happy that I managed to not binge this week. Don't get me wrong, night times are really, really hard. Like after Brett um, streams, he normally finishes about quarter to 10, 10 p.m. And we can't really go to bed before 12 a.m. Um, because Lola still is in the crate and she wakes us up really early if we go to bed early. So me and Brett do like our lions. <laughs> um, well, I do more than Brett. So we try to go to bed as late as possible. So them two, two and a half hours between him finishing us going to bed are the most hardest because they would be the times where I would sit down, have a packet of crisps while we have Netflix on or sit down and have some sweets or have some chocolate or I would leave my dinner till really, really late and I'd be in about 11 p.m. Um, before I started like my weight loss journey and in between the times where I wasn't doing YouTube and stuff like that I would slip back into really um, I would slip back into old habits that I don't really want to do so this week in terms of that has been really really good I have been doing things to keep my mind busy I sorted all the cupboards out in the kitchen um, threw a lot of stuff out been sorting like everything I've been sorting stuff around the house so I've just been doing things to keep my mind busy and not constantly thinking like about food and what I'm going to eat next. So yeah, that's that's all I can really think about that has happened this week. As I said, nothing about this week really stands out to me. I just feel like it's been a really, really good week um, on plan. So I'm going to stop blabbing because I've said over a million times that there's nothing that stands out to me. <laughs> so I will tell you how this week has gone weight wise. So as you can see, last week I gained three pounds and I was 24 stone three pounds. I never ever really know what to expect with a weigh-in. Um, there has been times where I have been 100% on plan and under my calories and in a calorie deficit and I've put on one, stood the same, put on four, put on like, put on whatever. And there's been times where I've binged every day of the week and I've lost like two. So my weight does tend to fluctuate quite a lot so i'm always nervous when it comes to weigh day but today this weigh day i have actually lost four pounds four whole pounds four four whole pounds i am absolutely shocked because that is such, such a big number. Even though I know my in myself, I have been on plan 150 million thousand percent. Oh, something on the camera lens. Um, I, I still always doubt it and I shouldn't. Um, I will put on screen the weight, like the scales and that. I am so happy with the results this week. Um, literally couldn't be happier. <sighs> I feel it feels good to be back into into the 23 bracket so overall that means I have lost two stone and one pound and I am three stone 13 pounds away from my first initial goal which is 20 stone um, my overall weight I want to be between like 10 13 10 11 13 stone um, that is such a long way away, but my goal for Brett's birthday, which is it, which is on the 23rd of June, we are going to Weymouth on holiday with his mum and dad, and I kind of want to be 20 stone, um, I'll be happy with 19, so I do have a goal in mind, so gonna try my hardest to get there, but for the week ahead, I'm just gonna do what I've done this week, I'm not gonna put any pressure on myself. I'm gonna keep drinking my water. I have realized I have drunk a lot more water than I normally have. So maybe that could be another reason as to why I have lost such a big amount this week. Water intake is so important. Um, I have drunk so much water this week. Like 
I had the two litre bottle, which I won't go into, but I'm not using it anymore. Um, I did find out that they might not be BPA free. And the two days that I did use it, not sure if it's connected, um, but the two days that I was using them, I had such a bad like migraine for them two days. My head was so bad. So I stopped using it and the headaches haven't come back. So might be in relation, might not be, but gonna keep drinking my water. Um, gonna keep trying to stay in my calorie deficit. I'm gonna try so hard not to binge this week. Um, I'm just gonna keep myself busy during the evening. And also we do take the dogs out during the day. Obviously not the past few days because it has been raining and the wind keeps blowing my little lily over but um yeah keep doing what i've done this week wouldn't change absolutely anything if i could lose four pound next week then i would be even more i'd be more than happy um but yeah that is it really for today's video if it is your way day today then i hope you get the results you want if you don't then don't worry tomorrow's a new day next week's a new week and i'm sure you will smash it everyone has ups and downs so try not to stress out too too much but yeah, I'm going to end today's video here. If you liked today's video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And also subscribe to the channel if you are new. And press the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. And I'll see you in next week's video. Bye.